Hello my dear family members, whatever placement exam you are giving, you must face verbalability problem, right? So keeping that in my mind today, I will discuss some important synonyms which are common in most of the exam, okay? And at the end of this video, I will be sharing some tips, pro tips on how to guess the synonyms effectively. So let's get started with the first question. So the first question is this. So what is the synonym for corpulent lean gaunt or emaciated or obese so please pause the video and try to answer this okay so i hope you answered already right so let's see the what's the meaning of leaning lean lean means thin or not corpulent okay and gaunt means extremely thin and emaciated means abnormally thin or wasted away okay and obese means excessively fat okay so what is the equivalent meaning of corpulent so corpulent means having a large or bulky body so most uh, similar word is obvious among the following okay so i hope you understood right so just wait till the end i'll share some pro tips how to guess the correct synonym okay so the next question is this what's the synonym of brief so this is very easy but there is a tips for remembering or for guessing the actual synonym okay so let's dis uh, let's discuss the question so limited means what limited means restricted in size or amount or extent okay and small means little in size and little uh, in little also this means small amount or small degree okay and short means limited in length okay so what's the synonym of brief so let me discuss the meaning of brief that is uh, it is coming from a latin word like brevis okay you don't have to remember this right now but the meaning of this is duration uh, i mean short duration in extent okay so the correct answer will be short because they are similar in meaning okay so let's go to the next question that is embezzle so what's the synonym of embezzle so misappropriate balance or remunerate or clear so the meaning of the embezzle will be one of them so please answer before i answer okay so if you can't then please hear me carefully so let's discuss the option so misappropriate means what to take something dishonestly or i mean uh, yeah to take something dishonestly okay and balance means what to make equal and remunerate means what to pay someone for services rendered okay and clear means to remove or get rid of something so what is the most similar word of I mean most similar meaning of embezzle so that is misappropriate okay because the the name i mean the meaning of those are quite same okay so let's go to the next question that is went so what's the synonym of went it uh, quite pronounced like uh, went like but this is not okay so here as you can see past tense of go is also an option so you can you, you can say that go went gone okay but this is went okay so what's the synonym of went so the opening stodge end or this so let's discuss the option so opening means what opening means a hole or gap okay and stodge means heavy food and end means the final point okay and this is obviously not an option so the uh, the meaning of went is actually uh, it is also an opening that allows air gaps or liquid to pass out okay so the correct meaning of that will be opening because they are both quite simple. so let's discuss so let me give you a quiz question so that you can practice okay so this is a quiz question harmonious what is the synonym for harmonious discordant tuneful or clashing or noisy so when i will share the tips please apply that in this question okay so let me show you the next question that is what's the meaning of august i mean what's the synonym of august so common ridiculous dignified or petty so the august meanings is what august meanings respected or impressive okay and common means what common means ordinary who is not respected okay and ridiculous means mockery right and dignified means who is having some respect okay and uh, pity means this is like a little importance okay so what is the quite similar meaning of august so that is quite similar with dignified okay so this will be the correct answer 
okay the next question is illuminate so what's the synonym of illuminate whatever exam you are giving like uh, tcs accenture cognizant or any company you will see this type of problems okay so what is the synonym of illuminate darken lighten hide dull before i answer the question i would recommend you to have the prime materials of any company that you want like tcs accenture cognizant take mahindra deloitte capgemini or mind tree infosys etc etc so if you want then please knock me at my study instagram.com slash techno.tf where you will get all the coding questions all the verbal ability abstract reasoning cognitive exceptions mock test and interview preparation as well okay so to get that please knock me at my study or you can also let me know in the comment section okay so darken means what to make or become dark and lighten means to make or become lighter or brighter okay and hide means to conceal and dull means lacking brightness or vividness so let's discuss illuminate so illuminate means what illuminate means to light up or to make clear so the quite similar meaning of illuminate is with lighten okay so that's why the correct answer will be lighten okay let's go to the next question that is fortify so what's the synonym of fortify so we can strengthen abandon or neglect okay so let me discuss the options so weaken means to make less strong and strengthen means to make stronger and abandon means to leave behind and neglect means to fail to or uh, to, to fail to care for okay so fortify means also make strong or strengthen so that's why the option will be uh, option b will be correct answer okay so i hope you understood right so if you can't understand then please wait a little i'll share some tips so that it will be more easier okay so let's go to the next question that is transparent okay so what's the synonym for transparent opaque clear hidden or cloudy so let's discuss the uh, options first okay so opaque means not allowing light to pass through okay and clear means easy to perceive or see through and hidden means concealed and cloudy means not clear okay so what's the correct meaning of transparent so transparent means also what easy to see through okay so that means the correct answer will be clear okay so i hope you understood okay so let's discuss the next question that is abundant so this is quite similar i mean quite a uh, familiar word abundant so let's discuss this so scare sorry scarce plenty little or rare so what will be the correct answer for this please pause and give the answer otherwise this will not be helpful okay and in the latest exams these are actually being repeated okay so please give and candid the last question this is very important and these are i mean repeated i mean like for 10 times 12 times right so what's the meaning of this scarce plenty little or rare so scarce means like in short so scarce means what so scarce means like in short supply and plenty means a large or sufficient quantity and little means a small in size or amount and rare means not common okay so and abundant means what abundant means like a large a large available quantities right so the correct answer will be plenty right this is quite similar with that so that's why option b will be correct answer okay so the last question of this session is candid okay so what's the synonym for candid indirect blunt deceptive or evasive so i hope you will pause and try to answer okay so the indirect means is not straightforward and blunt means direct and uh, unceremonious okay and this is this deceptive means misleading and evasive means avoiding directness okay so candid means also truthful and straightforward okay so that means the correct answer will be blunt okay so i hope you understood so this is the time to discuss about the tips so let's discuss those so the first pro tips is context clues so find context okay that means often the sentence or passage where the word is used can give you a hints about its meaning okay so for example if you come across a sentence like the corpulent man struggled to fit into the small chair okay so the context suggest that corpulent is related to being large or bulky as you can see in the first option i think we have discussed this okay so uh, the, the the synonym problem can be asked in this way also also you can be uh, you can be asked in like you, you will be given a sentence and you have to opt you have to guess from that okay so please utilize that so corpulent means obvious right that, that means large okay 
so the next clues is word roots so you have to find the word roots like knowing the roots of words can help you understand the meaning of unfamiliar, unfamiliar words right so for instance the word brief it comes from latin word brevis right so which means also short so brief relates to something which is short in size short in duration sorry short in duration okay so you have to apply word roots knowledge and you can say also like a u d i o d so if you know the meaning of audi then you can answer order city audience like this audio etc etc so you have to know the word roots so please uh, read some word roots from the google okay it will be very much helpful to you so what's the meaning of elimination so elimination like sometimes eliminating the obviously wrong choices can lead you to the correct answer right so here as you can see we have seen went means so went is not similar with went okay so past tense of go is went so here we eliminated this at the first thinking okay so this way we, if we just start uh, eliminating the options then we can get our desired answer okay so i hope you understood so the next tip is word families okay so words that belong to the same family can help you guess the meaning of a word right so for example the word vent is related to ventilation so which involves allowing air to pass through okay so thus vent likely means an opening right so i hope you understood so let me share the last quiz question for you that is this what's the meaning of innovative so please give the answer from the following options so i hope you will give importance whatever i have told here and if you found this video helpful then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding any company that you want and if you found this video helpful then please share this content with your friends so that they can also take help from this okay and if you want the prime materials of any company then please let me know in the comment section and if you want to discuss more about any company any corporate if you want to get hiring updates then please join our telegram channel t.me slash okay so thank you for today's session